There's been a push for years to revitalize downtown Las Vegas. Now a well-known business that was a big part of that effort for the past 10 years is moving out due to safety concerns. Kim Passoff live there tonight to explain. Yeah, here on Fremont Street East, the Hydrant Club, a dog boarding, training and social club is no longer operating here. They shut their doors for good just this past Saturday. When I moved into this neighborhood, there was literally nothing around. Walking down Fremont Street East, not far from Atomic Liquor, you may notice this giant yellow fire hydrant, the brainchild of Tony Shea, outside of the Hydrant Club. It's sad. Owner Kathy Brooks says safety concerns in the Fremont Street East downtown area have left her with no choice but to close this location. We formally closed December 31st, um, our last day of day school, like the last day there were uh, in day long classes was the 29th of December and about two hours after the last dog left the building, two people were shot about two blocks away. A decade ago, she moved to Vegas just to open this business. I worked in Silicon Valley for a bunch of years, and I'd say roughly around 2010, 2011, I had started just, I knew I wanted to do something different. I just wasn't quite sure what that next thing would be. And uh, Tony Shea, who was the CEO of Zappos at the time and a longtime friend, he said, well, why don't you visit Vegas this summer? In his apartment, there was a wall of post-it notes hopes and dreams for downtown. There were somewhere between a dozen and a dozen and a half post-it notes that had something to do with dogs. Brooks says he worked with her weekly to open up the Hydrant Club, and she hopes that his legacy, his commitment to downtown revitalization lives on, but she cannot stay. The kinds of threats that really led me to the decision that this neighborhood was no longer a safe place for a standalone small business uh, were things like gun violence, things like large groups of unruly individuals. But when a hundred guys drinking tall cans, getting hammered and getting stoned, riding bikes on the rear tire, the bike down the middle of the street, throw their bikes all over the front of your property. And when you ask them really politely, you know, hey, would you mind moving over so you're not obstructing the business? And I get called all manner of names. What am I going to do? So the business does not have a physical location at this point. They are still looking, but the business owner says there is a 0% chance it will be anywhere in this neighborhood. Reporting live on Fremont Street East, Kim Passoff, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas. For now, the owner is still running her dog training business, unleashed leadership wherever she can while she is still looking for a new permanent location.